Dawn on St. Martin's Island, the southernmost part of Bangladesh. This small island in the Bay of Bengal is, like Bangladesh itself, home to a composite mosaic of life. Its fine sand beaches are the nesting place for sea turtles, and the trees that line these beaches are home to a myriad number of birds. Below the surface of the water that surrounds St. Martin's is another world, rich in coral and the marine life for which Bangladesh, the land of water, is famed. This variety of life is what St. Martin's, indeed what the whole world, depends upon. The living networks of biodiversity provide all with the health, wealth, fuel, food and vital services. Yet on St. Martin's and elsewhere across Bangladesh, this diversity is being undermined, with irreversible species loss threatening the basic life support systems upon which so much life depends. The tourist boats, which each year bring thousands to explore the island's remarkable beauty, bring with them many environmental pressures. A lifeline to many who live on St. Martin's, the boats also mean more people, more roads and more construction than the island's fragile ecosystem can handle. Unplanned tourism is unleashing upon St. Martin's new challenges that, for its thousands of years of existence, it has not yet had to face. Overfishing of recent years has reduced fishery stocks, meaning that fewer fish are available to revive populations at the same time as fishermen are facing more and more demand for their catches. The increase in fishing in this delicate coral region also results in often irreversible damage to the unique reefs that lie below the water. A similar story is playing out inland, as land use changes and trees and vital biodiversity habitat is destroyed to make way for new construction and urban growth. This loss of habitat is a threat both for people and the environment they live in, as it is resulting in rapidly declining available space for housing and agriculture, as well as destroying the multitude of life in existence there. Added to these challenges is the threats posed by a changing climate. Bangladesh, prone to natural disasters, is also identified as a country likely to face the effects of climate change more than most. This may mean a compounding of the threats to biodiversity, and many more scenes like these, as freshwater sources are reduced, fishery stocks decrease, and further damage to the ecosystems that support these. It is a grim picture, but just as the problems lie in the way humans interact with the world around them, so too do the solutions. UNDP is supporting the people and government of Bangladesh to strike the right development balance that conserves biodiversity through positive change in people's lives. So the idea is basically to ensure the biodiversity conservation in longer term. And that's why we are really focusing on not only the biodiversity conservation itself, but also the people who depend on the biodiversity resources for their livelihood. It requires a very comprehensive plan, not only the visible area that we really see, but also any coral system, what you see, there is an actual area is more. It's in case of St. Martin's, uh, tourism is really a huge, huge pressure there. Every day, especially in peak time, peak season, five ships are going there. Thousands of people are going, so it's really putting huge pressure on this very fragile ecosystem. So there should be a very, you know, a very comprehensive tourism plan and also to really look at the ecosystem in a way so that proper, uh, proper zoning can be done. We are working with the government very closely, at, uh, both at policy level and also program level. So it's basically collaboration. Department of Environment, they are also working with us, but the challenge, the challenge is much bigger. In the spirit of partnership, this challenge is gradually being overcome. For the people living on St. Martin's, it means the preservation of their lives on this island in new and sustainable ways. It also means that the biodiversity of this tiny island is conserved for future generations of all kinds. Biodiversity is life, and its preservation is about our life.